back for another video blog. It's Victor and Matt from the 110 Sports Podcast. So uh, two successful college quarterbacks over the last few years have been Ohio State's Terrell Pryor and uh, just before that was Florida's Tim Tebow. Both have their own kind of issues as they enter the NFL now. When you look at the next two to three years, how do you see their careers panning out? I think they're both going to struggle in the NFL. I mean, Tebow's kind of struggled already. I don't see him changing that in a sense. And we, it's kind of too early to tell about Pryor. He just got drafted. But, I mean, he's going to the Oakland Raiders. And in a sense, that's not necessarily the best place to maybe, you know, have a young player, an immature player at times, <laughs> mature. <laughs> yeah. No, that is true. I and mean, you think Florida's Tim Tebow is in a good spot, though, with the Broncos? Well, I think the the thing is, is he would be if maybe he was the backup quarterback. But now that the fact that they, the, they've they already announced Kyle Orton as the starter and Brady, Brady Quinn, he's not going to be playing a lot. So you can be practicing all the time, but if you're not being, if you're not on the field, um, it's really tough to, to pr progress and stuff like that. So I think both guys are going to struggle. I think Terrell Pryor has a chance of succeeding more from the standpoint that his game is more ready, I think, than Tim Tebow. But, as you said, he's not in a great situation and he's got kind of uh, off-the-field issues where Tim Tebow is perfect off-the-field, but he's just his game isn't good enough. And supposedly, from all the reports from training camp in Denver, is he might be the fourth best quarterback on the team. Well, I mean, th another thing, too, is you know with Terrell Pryor is when he was in college, the Big Ten, while they do have uh, good athletes, with his size and his speed, he was out running cornerbacks, safeties, and stuff like that. In the NFL, it's going to be really different when you have linebackers that are chasing you down that are the same size. You can't run over everybody, and I think he'll learn that early on. And because of all the controversy with Terrell Pryor over the last few months, we kind of forget. We saw him at the Rose Bowl a couple of years ago. The guy is a pretty darn good quarterback, and he's a big, tall guy, and he yeah. won at the highest level in at Ohio State, playing against some pretty good teams. Yep. But uh, we'll see how that works out. If you're starting a franchise, though, Victor, today, and you only got two quarterbacks on the market, Tim Tebow or Terrell Pryor, who are you going to take? You know, it's going to be funny, but I think I'm going to go with Tebow. Even though he's gotten a lot of negative publicity, he's a winner. He won in college. He has that mentality that you know, he's going to do whatever it takes. And I want that guy. He's mature. He's mentally strong. And those immature issues that we've seen with Pryor over the last few months, I think would bother me. What if your major sponsor of the NFL team is like a tattoo shop? Would you then, <laughs> would you then bring Terrell Pryor on your team? I, have, I probably have to consider that a little more. <laughs> I think I would lean towards Terrell Pryor because maybe if he does kind of one day kind of you know, awake and maybe some of these issues aren't true, some of the allegations, maybe you got a, a good quarterback in, in, as a chance. Tim Tebow, I think we his game just isn't going to work in the NFL. I think we can both agree that uh, if you take either one to start a franchise, you're not going to be a very <laughs> so, good franchise very long. Unfortunately. <laughs> uh, coming up this Wednesday on the 110 Sports Podcast, we've got uh, an interview with head football coach Mike Stoops. He's uh, Arizona's football coach. And look at this. <laughs> this is pretty lame, isn't it? We've actually got Arizona's poster. They sent yeah. it to us. Nice. Very happy. Yep. <laughs> Every down, bear down. This is Arizona's official poster. We'll talk to him about this schedule because it's very tough starting off. Uh, we'll discuss a lot of other things. So join us Wednesday for episode 118 with Arizona's football coach Mike Stoops. We'll see you then.